Hello once again to the next episode of Breath of the Wild. Alright, let's turn this to the timer and keep going in here because it got night time already. I suppose that the people in here are going to go to sleep. No, actually, no, they say like they are like open 24 actually. Starlight Memories, a Ghibli shop. Hotel Oasis. Hi. Stop right where you are. Staying up late is bad for your skin, ma'am. I suggest you step inside and ask about our spa plan known by known by Vi the world over. It will heal your mind and body better than anything else. Well, there's people in here, actually. This is my turn, Jet. Oh, are you here because you heard the rumors about Roma, too? I heard that she has a special technique that will make you feel more relaxed than you have ever felt in your life. But nobody said the wait was going to be this long. I feel like I'll never know what relaxation is ever again. Ugh, I'm so annoyed. Well, are you just gonna stand there or are you getting in line? It was great. You're lying. This is dry head and all the sun you've gotten has completely dried out your skin. Rumors say that part of Roma's special skills will leave people feeling moisture up to perfection. I can't stand people when, when people like grr. Mm. Okay, I'm fine now. If I get angry, I'll create wrinkles between my eyebrows. Whoa. Don't make me angry. You are making yourself angry. Have you thought about that? So this place is... Oh, she's sleeping. What is it? I feel like I met you before, but I don't recall having any Highland acquaintances. Especially since I've only ever served in this palace. I've never even even set foot beyond the town's walls. I thought I could relax at last now that Vuliara has come of age, but then something like this happens. I'm retired now though, so there isn't anything I can do about, about it. A little while ago, a gang of thieves slipped into the palace and stole the chief's heirloom, the Thunderhelm. It's bad enough to be robbed in general, but... For the object stolen to be a valid heirloom belonging to our own chief? If I was still in charge, any guard who failed to catch those thieves would be doing some serious manual labor. And then they'd be thrown back into training, all the way from the beginning, no exceptions. Can I get up in here? <laughs> I suppose this is a canteen. A double canteen, yes. <laughs> Dude, this place is huge. I want to talk to everyone, but like... Ah, I'm getting lost already. I mean, not lost, but like... Still too many people to talk to. Alright, so I already talked to everyone behind... Actually... Oh, there is a... I'm gonna eat a lot of fruit. Our fruit here is sweet as can be, just like my wonderful daughter. Mm. My kid really loves fruit cake, so I make it every once in a while. I have all the fruit I'd ever need, but it's a bit difficult to find tabanta with cane sugar and goat butter. Anyway, if you have the ingredients, you should try making it yourself sometimes. I know, like talking to the people like behind the counter, you can like get different texts or something like that. Now that it's in the evening, it's gotten much cooler, hasn't it? You know, mushrooms enjoy the cool weather. You might find some around this. Take the time to look. Ah. It's between us. They're gonna keep their skin so beautiful thanks to the mushrooms that grow here. It will really be a waste if you left Gerudo time without taking some of these mushrooms with you. I have a lot of them already. Saba Saba. This is a city that doesn't sleep, so this story is always open. Unfortunately, being so busy means I don't often make it home to my husband. Your husband? Oh, oh yes, and a newlywed too. Many of the vendors who work these stalls are married, in fact. It's pretty typical of married Vi to live outside these walls. Really, but we come back to sell our wares, of course. Mm. It does it does mean I don't see my husband all, the, all that often, but we have to make a living. So Vi and sell all you like. Mm. We're fine getting less sleep than most folks, but with how dangerous the desert can be, it's good to stay alert. If you start feeling tired, be sure to take a break and get a good night rest. 
So like this girl is also like married as the as the one who married with Hudson. You have pink hair. What? Sava Sava. Oh. oh, are you interested in taking my class of Vo and you? I'm a shy. During the day, I teach a class on the Vo on the world, and at night, I teach cooking classes. Oh, this is a shy. So this is like the girl that that was like in a love triangle with the girl of the of the yearly. <laughs> Why don't you join us? Sava Sava. This class is absolutely critical for me. I've tried to cook up some great meals, but I only ever made dubious food. Oh. When you're cooking, if you add insects of more or monster materials, you'll end up with dubious food. Mm -hmm. Though if you ask me, there's nothing dubious about how absolutely inedible it is. Mm. People really crave calm cooking, huh? Rather than designing an elaborate meal, it's something better to make something quick using a few homemade ingredients. I should really write that down. Okay, so this is where a shy lives. Wait. So that's like for recipes. Actually, can I do more things with fairies or what does it fairies in there? Is it say that fairies truly do exist in the world, but they that they will only appear before an individual with a pure soul. One theory suggests that some special kind of cooking might be possible if you use the power of a fairy. I, Auritamu, have been a pure soul for over 35 years. I expect my fairy will arrive any day now. Most ingredients can imbue their meals with some unique effects. Ingredients that have cold properties can help you resist heat. Ingredients that have fertile properties can fully heal you and grant you temporally bonus vitality. There are many other effects to be found among the ingredients, you just have to experiment. And don't forget, combining ingredients with the same effect may increase the effects strange or duration. But combining ingredients with different effects may cancel their enchanting effects out, so you must be careful. Nobody else is happy? Yeah, I know. What food did you get, Rose? You can cook up an elixir by mixing a bug part and a monster part together. Elixirs can be made in pots, just like food, and with valuable ingredients. The, in the, the, the elixir effect will get stronger. You can also add acorns and chikalu tree nuts to import your elixir with minor healing properties. However, I, Aritamu, am deathly afraid of insects and will never even think of touching them. Fortunately, there are regular meals that you can cook which will produce the same effects as elixirs. Alright, we learn stuff. Alright, so I already talked to the people in here. Wait. What is a girl doing here? You're not a male. You're not a female. Or are you? Savasota. Anyway, good evening. You know the words are really hard to remember. I think Sav is part of half of them, but there's something starting with the V. Five O. I suppose this is a female Goran. Maybe. I cannot take pictures of the food. Rita. Potatoes with chicken, schnitzel, and carrots, and something I don't know the English word of. Evening. I really want to use the actual Gerudo greeting. Sava, you know. Sava. Wait, did you say that? Or I'm worried I'd mess it up and embarrass myself. Uh... You know, like. Look at me, I can speak another language. It just feels like bragging. I understand, actually. I understand this feeling. Every time, like, when I want to speak English, I'm like, oh my god, I think I'm gonna mess up and everyone's gonna think, like, I'm stupid. More stupid than I'm actually. Don't overthink it. You really think I'm putting too much thought into it? Maybe you're right. Here the town is so different from home. I live in Rito Village. We don't get many visitors there, so I'm not really familiar with non-Rito. But now that I'm in here, I should enjoy myself. I wanted to start by trying out some of the meat here, but... Uh... Well, they don't seem to have poultry. Did I really take my games, my game? I mean, I did to talk to Paya. <laughs> You're gonna put a picture? All right. 
Good evening. What do you eat for dinner? Meat. Good choice. You got you've got great taste. Thank you. Goodbye. Arrows. Fire. Ice. Shock. Bomb. How many should I wear up? All of them. You sure do need a lot of arrows. You're a strange little vi, aren't you? Yeah, I only I only have 256. Are you a traveler from abroad, a Hylian tourist? As you can see, I have some arrows for sale. You won't see a selection like this anywhere else. You browsing or buying? Oh, these girls are sleeping. A sack, buy a lot. Okay, no. Stomp, stomp. What? She wants to eat birth? I think she just said that, yeah. Okay, so I suppose that's where I actually have to go. Or as I tell, I always like to talk to everyone to see if there's like side quests or stuff. Actually, I never talked to the lady here. Like this one. Oh, look at this cute little Vi. I bet you will absolutely love what we have to offer, little one. We're an inn, of course, but we also have a special spa plan. A vacation for mind and body. It's really, really popular. So popular, in fact, that we always have a long line of people waiting to get in. Mm. Although, I don't know what it is, but I just feel something special from you. You can cut to the front of the line. Oh, I'm just going on and on. What can I do for you? The 90 rate is 20 rupees, but we also have a special spa plan that will bring the total of 80 rupees. Oh. You have never heard of the spa plan at Hotel Oasis? Mm. I, was sure it was, I, I was sure it was known the world over. The spa plan we offer will fill you with energy and a truly unique feeling of resilience to great dangers. And as an extra bonus, I'll feel like year, it'll feel like years of worry have been washed away, leaving your skin bright and smooth. Intriguing, right? What do you think? Oh. Have a work. Maybe later. That's what I say to everyone, actually. And I never come back. Oh, for example, this person has a side quest to me. Oh, oh you're that foreign Val. Bye. Sav Sava. Oh. Night after night, the voices of the people in the container can't inner. Come right in my window. They are super loud. If you stand on their window, you can hear everything they're saying. When I grow up, I'm always going to speak in a quiet voice, even if I'm having a really great time. Well, that's true. You have like two windows in here to go into the canteen. Hello. Mm. It was over there the whole time? I thought it's strange that the sandstorm over there never lifted. Huh? Huh? And what is a Hylian Vila yourself doing in here? What are you doing? Hmm. I am an archaeologist of sorts. I was just poring over some ancient text that I discovered the other day. <laughs> and I finally decoded it! Oh, she's so happy. Check it out. Well, part of it at, la at least. But the rest is not far off. With this discovery, I'll finally be able to make a name for myself as an archaeologist. Oh. Of course! You and I meeting here is no coincidence. I've never been one to question fate. I can't explain why, but I trust you for some reason. I'll let I'll tell you the details of my research if you can keep it a secret. My lips are sealed. Ah. There's a temple east of here, near the entrance to the Gerudo Desert. It's dedicated to the seven giant statues of the heroines, said to be the divine protectors of the Gerudo. It was at this temple that I originally discovered the ancient scripture. It reads, When the symbols of the seven find their place, the blessed path will be revealed. That's all I've been able to decipher so far. It's believed that people once came from around the world in search of the heroine's blessings. But as far as I can tell, it doesn't appear that anyone has found it yet. Blessing? I'm not sure what exactly it means, but maybe I'll find one. I'll, I follow out once I've deciphered more of the text. 
I'm not sure if this is if this is related, but it's said that heroines held powers that were part of a bigger whole. Each heroine had a different power, skill, spirit, endurance, knowledge, flight, motion, and gentleness. One, two, three, four, six, seven. But they all look the same to me. <laughs> I should understand the entire script before long, but that's only the beginning of my problems. Uh... That divine beast has been moving around the area, making it harder for me to conduct my research. The thing has no respect for academia. Okay. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. So these are two different ones? I thought they were like... Same quest. Because this one says, they say that the swordsman is set to point the way to a treasure. And then this one says, like, there's seven herrings. And they have something like a hidden shrine. I'm pretty sure, like, these two are gonna be like, the exact same shrine. Oh, there's that thing here. Oh, wait. I don't know if I want to enter here, actually. Oh, probably not. <laughs> At least not now. Can I... Alright, let's go back to the canteen. The canteen is the, place, the only place that I haven't visited yet. And of, co of course, that place that I just saw. Hello. Basak. Basak. Oh, are you a Halian Vi? We don't see too many of you. I can't tell how old you are, but you look a little young to be coming to my shop. You see, we mix special drinks here. Drinks that are definitely just for adults. Wait, so you think that I'm not like... Like, old enough? I mean, I can show you my ID. Well, a big part of the drink is the ice we use from the ice house. It makes them especially refreshing. Well, you're a little too young to be here, don't you think? Oh. Our featured cocktail is called Novel Pursuit. Many of our customers come here specific specifically to order it. The light, sweet taste, the cool sensation from each sip is like drinking distilled motivation. How about milk? Milk? We don't care anything as childish as milk here. Is Greta tell you to come here and ask that? That store clerk is just playing a, playing a prank on me. Mm. Good grief, doesn't she have anything better to do with her time? She's always being so secret secretive about her job, but hiding something just makes young people more interested. Mm. That reminds me, I haven't seen Pokey around lately. She used to come here every day to drink at no Novel Pursuit too. <sighs> oh, I'm sorry, I don't know why I'm even telling you this. I'll, I'm gonna tell you that I'm a hundred years old, it seems. It seems. Hello. Oh, well, there, was, well, there was a person behind me all this time. Savasar. Mm? Oh, dear. <laughs> you definitely don't look old enough to drink here, Jet. How old are you, really? I'm over a hundred. What a funny vibe you are. When you're older, let's have a drink together. You don't believe. Look at look at the look at the sight of disappointment. He's drunk. Oh my god! Wait 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 wait. Yo, yeah, welcome back, you may shiver lord. I don't like girls twice my height. What's he mean by that? I'm only eight feet tall. How much is eight feet in centimeters? He doesn't look that tall, actually. No, she actually does. Hi. Ah, and those that close soul that fashion passion. I was thinking about buying some myself. How do they feel? Comfy? <gasps> say, are you? Uh, I really don't know how to say it. You be... a boy? No. No. <laughs> you are. I knew it. 
It's really impressive you getting in here without anyone else noticing. You don't need to worry, I won't tell a soul. Just a little secret between us, Hylian. Bye, right? Gills. No. Don't say anything. 243 centimeters. Is this Zelda? It is. What did I do to the- I didn't do anything to this girl! I like to be the one to do the cooking. Jerk waits until after I take the cooking class to tell me this. Oh, she has like different... Only two different ones. It's okay. I'll take you. I mean, what? <laughs> oh, I was going to tell you. I finally got my hands on the password for you nowhere. Oh. Seriously? Wow, that place is a little crazy, isn't it? Uh... Maybe, but I'm really interested. <laughs> anyway, the password is... Mm. Wait a second. Yeah. You. Do you really think we wouldn't see you standing there listening to our conversation? So rude. This is a private conversation. Go away. <laughs> oh, this is, it's exactly the same thing. Uh, oh. <laughs> mm. huh? What if I talk to you? <laughs> oh, it's exactly like the uh, same uh... <laughs> conversation. Yeah. But it's okay. It's fine. You don't have to tell me. I cannot listen from here. What about here? Ah. Uh. I can use her belly. <laughs> Wait. I mean, I wouldn't mind. I mean, what? What was up with that little high and fire earlier, anyway? Oh. Forget her. Just hurry up and tell us the password, Jido. <laughs> oh, that's right. The password is GSZ Gold, Silver, Crystal, Diamond. I overheard Sala talking about it, so I'm sure that's right. All right, that's a that's a really that's a really easy way to remember. Gold, Silver, Crystal, Diamond. Gold, Silver, Crystal, Diamond. What could that? Oh, I get it. Gerudo Secret Club. No, no, no. It's gold, silver, crystal. But what's this diamond at the end mean? Mm. Who knows? Gold, silver, crystal is a password. You heard it here. Now I think that I cannot enter <laughs> because I already messed up the password today. It seems. Little secret club, I know, I know, they just told me that. Oh. What's the password? Gold. Oh. Silver. Mm -hmm. Crystal. Mm -hmm. Diamond. Oh. Alright, you can come in. Wait. Who was talking to me then? Who was talking to me that there's no one in here? What? I'm scared. Oh. Oh. Hey, I haven't seen your face around here before. Hmm. <laughs> Looks like we got ourselves a rare visitor. I guess I have a suspicious mind, so maybe you don't ask too many questions and I won't either. You're a member here now, so thanks for your patronage. Oh. Desert Vote Trash. I already have this. What about this? Oh. oh no! That's a special one, made using Lumios stones. If you're interested, you'll need to trade me the materials. Oh, and there's a handling fee too. Well, what is it? Radiant mask. I need three. Radiant shirt. I need three. Radiant tights. I need three also. 800 each. 24 in total. I want that. I 
I already bought these ones in the other side, so I don't have to buy this anymore. I do want this, but I'm gonna I think I'm gonna save more money. Pokemon games. <laughs> well that's exactly what I was trying to do. <laughs> in their voice. I literally tried to reference Pokemon in there, by the way. <laughs> Very cool looking. I, I want to get it. I want to get it. Okay, now. Wait. Heels. Chill shrooms are great, but the knives here are so cold. Maybe I should get some sun shrooms instead. A Halian Vi, huh? Savota. My mom often said that dishes with mushrooms were good for nursing serious headaches. So when I'm feeling tired, I always make fragrant mushroom salad tea. I love that curry flavor. It's a simple dish that you can make if you have some garden spice and mushrooms. Right now, it's daytime, so maybe... The person in here... It's gone. <laughs> well... So the person in here said like she was doing something at daytime and something nighttime. So that's why like I, I came here to see if she was in there, but she's not in there. So. But now that the kids are awake. Sorry, but I can't play with you right now, lady. What are you doing? I'm pretending to be Lady Urvosa. Lady Urvosa was an amazing person who was born a long, long time before I was. She was a champion who saved the town from an evil ghost. I'm going on patrols every day to make sure that no more bad monsters show up. I like talking to everyone, by the way. Probably you already noticed. <laughs> So I'm, I'm trying to find, I'm trying to search for the, for Ashai. Also the other girls that were like in here sleeping, oh there's one there. Hey lady, be sure to buy a lot of stuff, okay? I would recommend the ice arrows if you shoot them at something. <laughs> Crack! Frozen solid. Do you have a quest for me or something? Oh wow, you're a Vi from out of, out of town. I was just pretending to be a horse. Why? What? You don't know about horsey fatback? You don't have one where you're from? There's this really big horse thing that walks around outside the village like stump stump. If you get close to him, he goes kaboom. And... Bzz, bzz. <laughs> it's really exciting. But I think horsey fatbacks is actually good. He's only in a bad mood because everyone keeps saying he is bad. Oh, you mean the beast? That's not a fatback horse, that's a camel. Well, technically it's a machine. Yeah, hello, Henrik. Where is a shy? Maybe she's in the canteen. Oh, there's... Are you the same person that I talked to before? What's a vibe from out of town doing in a place like this? What are you doing? I'm still keeping it a secret from Mama, but I'm growing a fruit garden here. Then I can eat all the fruit I want until my tummy gets filled right up. Aww. I haven't figured out what I wanted to plant here yet, though. <gasps> if I grow a lot, I'll share some some if you, some it, some of it with you, okay? Here. It's a shine here now. I mean, Jules is not in here. Mm. I was just thinking. It's been a while since I saw Caliban around. Oh. Now that you mention it, I don't think I've seen her in town lately either. Mm -hmm. Me neither. Mm. You don't think she's... Mm. Wait a second. Eh? You, did you really think we wouldn't see, we'll see you're standing there listening to our conversation? So rude, this is a private conversation. Go away. Are you still sad? Mm. Stupid bow, who needs them? You know what? We're gonna we're gonna set a timer. We're gonna continue. A hundred years old. So we're gonna. 
in English that means it means hello or, or good evening or something like that. All right, so we're gonna keep going. If you're watching this in Twitch, stay in here. If you're watching this in YouTube, thank you for watching. I'll see you again in the next episode, okay? Bye.